Hi, and welcome to Soulful Sunday. I'm um, sitting out here on a beautiful fall day, the first, second day of fall, I guess it is. Um, and the flower essence that came up this week was the flower essence of black cohosh. And it came up under the area of courage. And this one's really interesting because it talks about um, being able to own, I guess, the shadow parts of ourselves and others. And what it talks about is really people who um, have attracted to them relationships, um, whether through business or personal life, that are um, shrouded in abuse or addiction or threatening circumstances. And so when we attract that kind of stuff to us, that generally means that we need to learn a lesson too because we attract relationships to us that need to teach us um, parts of ourselves. So this one really talks about owning that shadow part of ourselves and owning um, that we do have those shadow parts in us, those parts that we don't like to talk about, those parts that um, can be abusive or addictive or um, harmful or hurtful. Um, a lot of us suppress this and uh, that's a good thing that we don't act on it, but it's we also disown them. So when we have those thoughts, we think we're bad or we think we're um, not worthy or that we're a bad person or that we're crazy or those kind of things. And those thoughts are just part of that. We do have that part of ourselves and we definitely don't have to let it out, um, but we need to own it and know that that's a normal part of it. Um, so what this one really talks about is being able to own those shadow parts of ourselves um, and to be able to confront them and, um, and deal with situations in a positive way. Uh, so whether that be if it's in the relationships that you're attracting to yourself or whether that be you're looking at kind of those shadow parts of yourselves, um, it's owning it and, and being okay with it and seeing it in a positive light. Um, I hope this kind of makes sense. I know this is kind of a deep one, but um, for those of you who maybe do have that um, attraction to kind of those addictive relationships or threatening relationships, um, I think of, for this one, I think of a lot of my friends in social work who are often in circumstances where um, the, their clients that they work with have those, are displaying those shadow parts of themselves um, and putting, them, putting themselves in those kind of situations. Um, so if this is kind of you, you just simply need to ask for the um, flower essence of black cohosh to come into your energy field, energy body and physical consciousness and then ask it to assist you with being able to own and positively use uh, those shadow parts of yourself or others um, and then you simply just take a deep breath and feel the energy come in. Usually you'll feel it somewhere in your body, feels like a wave, feels like a tingle. It's different for everyone and um, it's kind of neat because everyone feels it in a different place in their body when they do it. And as always, if you are interested in a flower essence reading, and I know we've been through some recently some really tough times with energy, with the full moon that just came, some big shifts in energy, um, things like that. And fall is an amazing season where uh, nature, if we follow the cycle of nature, fall is all about releasing what's not good for us. Um, it's about letting go of our old beliefs, our letting go of um, things that aren't serving us anymore. And so if that is you and you're needing some help with that releasing, the flower essence reading can really help you do that. Uh, so if you have questions, um, you can check out my website or you can contact me and we can have a talk about that. I wish you all well. Happy Sunday.